Which equation represents a line that is parallel to the line whose equation is 3 halves x minus 3? And pass it through the point 1, 2. Well, the first thing you got to know is that the 3 halves is the m, and the negative 3 is the b. So it's in the form of y is equal to mx plus b, and so are all these answer choices. Well, when two lines are parallel, their slopes are the same. I'll point that out later when I show you a Desmos graph. But if this one's slope is 3 halves, then we already know that the answer is going to have 3 halves for its slope. So I just replace that where I see the m. So instead of putting m, I'll put 3 halves. We still don't know what the b is yet, though. So we can use the fact that it has to pass through the point 1, 2 which means that when we plug in 1 for x and 2 for y, we'll figure out what the value of b would have to be. No pun intended. That's a really crappy joke, but let's continue. Then 3 halves times 1 is 3 halves, and then I changed 3 halves to 1.5, and then I subtracted the 1.5 from both sides, and I got 0.5. But 0.5 can be written as 1 half. Why did I do that? Because that's the way they're writing it. And then you take the 1 half and you just plug it all the way back into 3 halves x plus b. And instead you have 3 halves x plus 1 half. So that's our answer, number 1. But let's take a look at the Desmos graph. So I've already plugged in 3 halves x minus 3 and also 3 halves x plus 1 half. And you can see that they're parallel. In fact, it doesn't matter what the b is, it only matters what the m is. So I'm going to turn off this one and turn off the one where I created a slider for the b. And I've got it started at 0.5, but that b could have been anything. If it was at 1, it's still parallel. If it's at 2, parallel and so on and so on it doesn't matter all it does is it moves the line up and down 